The following video is brought to you by WWE Slam Crate, a bi-monthly mystery box for fans of the WWE loaded with exclusive and authentic collectibles and apparel that you can't get anywhere else. Sign up today and save 10%. What's up, everybody? Tony Beats Guy here, back with my career, episode number three. Let's see where we're going here. We lost against Samoa Joe. Not cool. Self promotional tutorial. We're going to let you cut your first promo today. It's just in the ring talking and get the best score possible. Your trainer will pretend to be the crowd. Try to get a strong reaction out of. The WWE Universe. The best WWE superstars are more than top level athletes. They are masters of the microphone. Give me a hell yeah. How you doing? You want some? Finally. The WWE Universe is larger than life, and you need to be larger than life as well to win over the crowd. If you submit. Will you be their hero? What the rock is cooking? Or will you give them a villain they can believe in? I didn't need you to win the title, and I don't need you to get it back. Just as it is in the ring, idiot. Sometimes words themselves become the battlefield. There's only one word to describe you. You have never beaten me. Because you can't beat me. Because I am better than you. Or you may find yourself squaring off with the authority itself. Now I'm the authority. You see, you don't own them. You will respect me because I will be the face of your company. But no matter how you decide to cut your promo, one rule holds true. Go big or go home. Austin 316 says I just whipped your ass. In the million! The champ is here! Okay, being a WWE superstar is not just about being a good wrestler. You have to be charismatic. We're going to let you do your first promo today. We'll pretend to be the crowd. If I can give you one piece of advice, every crowd in every city is different. Putting on a good promo is all about working the crowd. Keep that in mind today. All right, we're going to cut our first promo here. Like you said, every crowd is different, so we have to pay attention to what type of crowd we're at. Uh, that's weird. Not weird, but it's going to be difficult, I think. Let's see what kind of promo we can cut today. I've got something to get off my chest. You'll know my name. My competition is inferior. I deserve opportunity. I've beaten some of the best WWE superstars on this roster. I've lost to some of the worst. It's just how the world spins in the WWE. But still, I demand that I get the best opportunities around because I am me. Well, that wasn't good. That was awful. Why did I do that? I shouldn't have chose that one. That was bad. But the performance is uh, decent. We're going down as a face. Do I complain a lot stage fright? Should I join the paint chip eaters? What? There seems to be a trend going around here lately. The more paint chips you eat, the more you get noticed. Well, I don't know about you guys, but I'm not another lemming. Looking for someone to tell me what to do. I'm a WWE superstar. A superstars and superstars carve their own path to greatness. And if anybody around here notices me, I'm going to do something to make them notice. Oh, if nobody notices me. This is weird. Why what why would you talk about paint chips? Alright. I'm issuing an open challenge. I'm not going to wait my turn. Did you guys know what these are? I do whatever it takes within the rules. I'm not going to win. There are some people who think I should sit back and wait my turn. Look, no disrespect to other superstars in the back, but I want my shot because I know I can beat someone in the locker room. I know I can be the WWE World Heavyweight Champion. 
All right, I don't know if I'm being a face or a heel. I'm just kind of choosing. We'll see. Let's go promo. Continue promo. The authority can hide all they want. I earned a pay-per-view match. I need a servant. I'll fight for you. Pay-per-view matches aren't things to take lightly, which is why I am confident that I've earned one. It doesn't matter who you put a, me up against. I'm not going to sweat it. All right, my promo performance is going up. Going up as a face a little bit. It's just weird I'm bouncing back and forth. They should have chose the first one, but... What am I trying to say is the universe, the last words. So these are the last words. Uh, I'll just say hi, mom. Why not? And before I go, I'd like to say the two words I've always wanted to say in the ring. Hi, mom. Oh, man. That was even cooler than I thought. Thanks, guys. You know what? Maybe I'll even have my mom bake us all cookies if I end up getting what I asked for. Come on, Triple H. Do it for your mom's cookies. Okay, I should get out of here before he changes his mind. But seriously, they're delicious. <sighs> My promo performance went way down after I did the high mom line. I thought it would have been funny. But I gotta take this serious. So there it is. Won an achievement or a trophy or something. Cutting my first promo. Kid, you're a natural. Next week, we'll really see what you're made of. So be ready and be sure to practice up. So there was my first promo ever. Anyway, guys, if you enjoyed this, make sure you hit that like button. As always, Tony Beats Guy 2. Sweet!